Hey, we're back in the whale. I had a dime for every time I heard that. Um, okay, so what do we do? Well, first, there seems to be something floating here. Well, first, let's look. Look. Oh, okay. We already read that. Uh, smell. Sniff, sniff. <laughs> okay, we discover something new every single time we play this game. Uh, look, bottle. You don't have it. Okay, get bottle. Okay. Alright, let's see. Uh, open bottle. You open the glass bottle and retrieve the imprisoned note. Read. Note. Sludge Vohal is holding me prisoner in Space Quest 2. Help me out of this jam! I wonder what that alludes to. Okay, so here we need to get on top of the tongue. This takes a while. So, uh, be patient. Yes, you only have a certain amount of time before you die in here. Sweet. Well, I think you can do it from the other side, too. I usually do it from the other side. Yeah. I just wanted to look at it. The skeleton of an unlucky man. Let's call him James. Rests atop the wreckage of a small boat. What do you want to do with the peacock feather? <laughs> okay. Use feather on Evula. Tickle. Well. Frantically tickle the throat of the whale with a big peacock feather. You begin to feel a quiver under your feet, which quickly turns into a mighty tremble. Suddenly, you hear a thunderous... <laughs> and you are swept out of the whale's mouth in a tremendous wave of ocean water. Again, you find yourself swimming in the ocean. Splash. <laughs> Flash, flash. <laughs> There's an island up there. Cool. Look. You have found yourself stranded upon a desert island. Also, it seems uh, have others before you. Also, it seems have others before you. Now, what are you going to do, Rosella? Oh, now, okay, now I remember what you do. Watch. Oh, wait, never mind. You have to feed him the fish. Oh, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Type in Look James. Hey, we're facing the other way now. Just in case you wanted to see that. <laughs> yeah. Well, if you want to make some different with this one, it's too crazy. You throw the sinky, dead fish to the pelican. Greedily, he catches it in his large bill. As he does, 
you notice something shiny fall from his bill onto the ground. Ooh, mm, shiny. Look at the ground. You see a shiny whistle lying on the ground. Get whistle. Now this is the part that <laughs> you really kind of just have to know. No. Look down. <laughs> you look at the ground inside the wrecked boat. What is this? Why, it's a golden bridle. You pick it up and carry it with you. So yeah, if you didn't know that, screwed. Put the shiny silver whistle to your lips and forcefully blow into it, producing a loud tweet. To your astonishment, a friendly dolphin appears just offshore and jabbers excitedly at you. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> no! Uh. The dolphin is gone. <laughs> I felt like <laughs> For those of you who have never actually ridden a dolphin in real life, let me tell you, it's a once in a lifetime experience. Thank you so much. <laughs> I've always wanted to go to this place called Discovery Cove where you can play with dolphins. And I happened to be out of town one time. And my brother happened to go when I was out of town. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Delphi. He says you're welcome. It's for you. <laughs> Alright, now we finally have the bridle. There we go. Oh, wait, you know what? <laughs> wait a There we go. You aim one of Cupid's golden arrows <laughs> toward the beautiful unicorn. You let go of the bow string. Zing! Bullseye. The magnificent unicorn is no longer afraid of you. It's now your friend. But thank you for coming back to the center of the screen. <laughs> I don't know how I could be closer. As the beautiful unicorn offers no resistance, you gently place the golden uh, bit into its mouth and fit the bridle and reins over its majestic head. The unicorn looks at you with curiosity. Hmm. Okay. You nimbly mount the magnificent unicorn, grab the golden reins, and set off toward Lobot's castle. And folks, we're almost out of time here, so I'm going to stop the video, uh, and then we're going to continue to see what happens, and hopefully Lalat will let us free after we did her bidding. Alright, thanks for watching.